Welcome to Life Effects. I'm Dave and this is where I do stuff with effects. Today I only have a quick but very effective trick for you. How can I select specific points on my geometry by only using VEX logic? For demonstration I just create a box geometry and I will keep it as polygon mesh because I want to see the divisions I create. To make it a bit more pleasant for the eye, I make sure that the box will always stay on the zero line in the y-axis. For that I copy the y-attribute of the size and make a reference for the center on the y-axis and divide it by two. With that the box always stays on top of the grid, no matter what size it is. To make this example very simplistic, I choose a size of 4x4 four four and 3 on the y-axis. And for this example, this box needs a few more points. And the idea is, with a given geometry like this, how can I select specific points by using one single Wrangle node? So let's create the Wrangle and I will call this one only corners, because I want to try to select only the corner points of this box. And one possible solution for this problem is to create a point cloud. A point cloud is a list of all the points that are located in a specific area. You can create this cloud with the command PC open and we specify the area by using the position information. And I want to search for points with a radius of 2.1. Since my box is 4x4, any selected point will only be able to find its direct neighbors and the 10 is just the maximum number of points. So now I created a point cloud from the perspective of each individual point. And that allows me to create a condition what happens if the number of points found in this cloud has a specific count. Like I said, with this first example I wanted to just select the corner points. So I want to grab every point that has more than three points in its cloud. That will, for example, select this point here in the middle, because a cloud from this point will contain itself and all the four points that are connected with it. And now that I defined which points are relevant, I'm going ahead and just remove them. So I type in remove point, take the first input and deliver the current point number. And as you can see, this deleted every point except for the corners. And that's because every corner point only has itself and its two neighbors. You can achieve a different result easily by reversing the selection process. If you want to keep the middle and only delete the corner points, you just have to change the condition to select a point cloud which is exactly equals 3. And with that, the Wrangle node deletes only the corner points. Another possible outcome would be to select only the two points in the center. To achieve that, you only have to select all the point clouds that have less than five points. And that means we can make a fourth variant, since we now know that these middle points have a count of five. We just take the node that deleted the corner points, which was done by selecting all the clouds with exactly three points, and we just add something to that condition. And that is the point cloud with five, so we can delete also the center points. And there you have it, four different ways to locate a specific set of points. I hope you found something useful and are back next time.